It was a simple story about a boy who was lost and a girl who was broken. They fought alongside a survivor, a war veteran, and a fallen knight. I led them into battle against an evil so terrible it tried to black out the stars. We fought for each other. We fought for those who could not. But we never imagined it would end like this. This is a time of difficult choices. Sometimes impossible ones. Oh, Boca Tan! At least we've got out of fighting. All paths are coming together now. It's time to get to work. Oh! <laughs> the balance is right. Oh. We were meant to be Jedi so we could be here now. When your phone needs us most. This is AD Do It All Day here at Star Wars Celebration. Uh, as you guys can see, I am actually in my hotel room, actually in the bathroom uh, recording this video uh, because my brother is in the room sleep and I don't want to disturb him. But I wanted to make sure I got this video out, so please forgive the background. So uh, what you guys just saw there was the trailer reaction to the Star Wars Rebels Season 4. Uh, trailer. Uh, so um, as you guys could see, there's a lot of uh, awesome stuff in there. Um, Sabine and Ezra and Kanan are all back and uh, we're getting some new characters as you guys saw. If you watch the panel, uh, you'll know that we're going to get some new characters here uh, this season. Warwick Davis will be playing a, a new character, kind of sort of a new character, but they've uh, again pulled from Legends and uh, brought, uh, brought back uh, one of the uh, characters that uh, goes along with Thrawn, and I, I don't want to mispronounce the name, but I believe it's Brock. Uh, and um, this is actually his bodyguard. Uh, so, um, and, and not to spoil anything for anybody, but if you know anything about Legends and what happens to Thrawn, uh, this, this particular character is a key character uh, to Thrawn's uh, uh, story arc. Uh, so it's very interesting that we're getting that aspect uh, for uh, Rebels Season 4. Uh, one of the other huge reveals uh, out of that panel is that this is the final season for Rebels. Um, so, and that's kind of what I expect, uh, expected and speculated on, that this would be the final season. We are coming right up uh, to Rogue One uh, with Rebels, so um, they most definitely need to conclude this story. So we're gonna get uh, 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 an ending for Ezra, uh, an ending for Kanan. Uh, we have some idea uh, of uh, Hera's future uh, in regards to uh, Rogue One. If any of you guys saw that, you know that uh, what I'm talking about there. Um, Zeb, we, we're not sure what his fate will be, uh, but we most definitely will find that out. And then of course we have Sabine. Um, and then, of course, if, again, if you guys saw the panel, uh, there was a reference to uh, the Mandalorians and that we would see uh, quite a few uh, uh, story arcs involving the Mandalorians. So if you are a fan of the Mandalorians, 
Uh, I'm sure that is something that you are very, very excited about. Um, so a lot of great stuff out of that panel, uh, a lot of great footage out of the trailer. Uh, and then those of us who were lucky enough uh, to get into the uh, panel, and uh, incidentally, I wasn't in the main room uh, with Filoni and uh, all of the cast there. Uh, I was in a separate room that was uh, st got a stream feed uh, of that particular panel. Um, just so you guys are aware, no, I was not in the actual room. Uh, I was in a separate room that uh, received the stream uh, for that. However, uh, we did get uh, our look at the first episode uh, for season four. Uh, I will not be spoiling anything about that uh, here in this video. Uh, so you guys are safe uh, at this moment. But what I will say uh, about that particular episode, uh, it is a key uh, episode, a very nice start uh, to season four. Um, and as Filoni mentioned uh, in the uh, panel, uh, this most definitely will be a dark season. So uh, there is a lot to look forward to. And I can tell you guys, and, and it's, it's unfortunate that uh, we have to wait uh, till this fall uh, to get uh, this first episode. Um, because I can tell you, it's a great episode, guys. So um, the excitement is through the roof, as you can see with that reaction of the crowd to that trailer. Uh, and then, of course, uh, when we got an opportunity to see uh, that first episode, uh, I mean, the, 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 the room exploded. Uh, so uh, it was an absolutely great time. I, I absolutely enjoyed myself. I'm having a ball here at uh, Celebration. And and oh, the other thing here, guys, I wanna apologize that I haven't put uh, up any content uh, prior to today. Uh, I had some really poor internet service uh, for the past few days that didn't allow me to upload any uh, uh, video or footage um, that I took here at Star Wars Celebration, but I will uh, uh, post that footage and, and images uh, here on the channel. Uh, as well as uh, post those out to my uh, various uh, Star Wars Facebook groups. So if you guys are uh, watching this video, you can look forward to that content as well. Uh, so guys, I, I wanna thank you very much for watching this video. And again, we have a lot to look forward to uh, for Rebels season four. Uh, again, this will be the final season of Rebels. Uh, and I'm sure uh, they will announce what the next animated series will be. Uh, very shortly or, or probably sometime probably around the mid-season break for Rebels um, so that's also going to be some news uh, that we're going to have to look forward to as well uh, so guys let me know what your thoughts are on that trailer and that reaction that you guys saw uh, are you excited for season four uh, is was there anything that you noticed uh, in that trailer that uh, you have questions about or theories about, uh, put those uh, thoughts and, and, and theories into the comments. Let's start a discussion about this season four, this final season uh, of Rebels, guys. But again, uh, thank you very much for watching and may the force be with you always.